Westfield, Indiana is a growing suburb located just 25 miles north of Indianapolis. The city is currently experiencing tremendous growth with a 300% growth rate and approximate population of 30,000. CNN Money Magazine named the city of Westfield one of the top 50 best places to live for 2013. Over the last two or three years, the growth of the city has been phenomenal. As the economy regained strength, growth spiked with construction of multiple subdivisions and community projects. The Grand Park project that the city started in 2012 is the largest sports facility in Indiana and in all of the Midwest. The rapid growth of the city and addition of this project has added pressure for new infrastructure and facility upgrades to prepare for the continued growth. Citizens Energy Group of Westfield is a broad-based utility service company providing natural gas, thermal energy, water, and wastewater services to about 800,000 people and thousands of businesses in the Indianapolis area. The Citizens Energy Group manages 26 lift stations in the Westfield area. American Pump Repair and Service Incorporated is a pump distributor that specializes in providing, servicing, and maintaining pumps for municipal, commercial building, and industrial customers. American Pump Repair and Service Incorporated started working together with citizens on the Westfield lift stations for the past five years. Crane Pumps and Systems is a manufacturer of pumps, accessories, and services based out of Piqua, Ohio. Crane Pumps and Systems provides solutions for municipal, commercial, industrial, residential, and military market segments. American Pump Repair and Service Incorporated provides customers, including Citizens Energy Group, with pumps manufactured by Crane Pumps and Systems. One of the 26 lift stations that Citizens is primarily responsible for supporting is the Grand Park Sports Complex and a local retirement home. This lift station is a duplex lift station that previously operated with two 10 horsepower pumps that were clogging multiple times a week. The area's growth required a look at some possible upgrades. The biggest problem we have with this list station is it's on with the, one of the larger sports complexes and it's the flows change periodically due to people being in and out and uh, how the events are scheduled. And we also have a retirement village that's on there. So we have a lot of hand wipes and things of that nature that are plugging the pumps day and night, all hours of the day basically. We get called out two to three o'clock in the morning or two or three times a week at least to pull and de-rag these pumps. We have a, quite a bit of ragging issues at this station with the uh, nursing home up the road, the expansion of Grand Park, clogs our pumps, causes them to bind up, trip breakers. We have to come and physically pull the pumps out of the stations, disassemble the pumps, pull the ragging problem out, put them back together and reinstall the pumps. Causes a lot of late nights, overtime, unnecessary work for us. The first month that we started to experience it after Grand Park opened it was 30 to 40 hours a month of overtime costs specifically on weekends. The focus for Citizens Energy Group was to upgrade the lift station to not only larger pumps to handle the additional growth in population but also a vortex design that could better handle ragging and the high volume of solids coming into the lift station during Grand Park's peak hours. The upgrade needed to eliminate the frequent maintenance trips necessary to derag or unclog the pumps. And read an article about a Barnes pump and then I was told by a vendor about the capabilities of the non-clog issue of the Barnes pump. So it piqued my interest, which led to a trip to Crane facility in Pickwell, Ohio. During that facility tour, we got to sit down and watch the pumps being tested by, I mean, they were throwing pantyhose and all kinds of stuff in that passed everything with no problem. So really made me want to put a pump in just to try. We went three years before we ever had to pull a pump and we were pulling those pumps once a week. So the tremendous amount of savings and time alone was well worth the effort. American Pump Repair and Service Inc.'s Jimmy Parks reviewed the lift station requirements with citizens and deemed that the lift station should be upgraded with a new rail system and larger pumps to better accommodate the continued growth of the area. Crane's Barnes Solid Handling Series Vortex design and features could solve citizens' ongoing ragging issue. 
Although Barnes SH pumps can be easily installed on almost any existing rail system, a new rail system was installed at this site to accommodate larger sized pumps. The ability to go two hours east of us and get parts for that pump is also a great benefit because we didn't have to worry about a 10 to 12 week lead time on parts. I mean, we're looking at probably one to two weeks of lead time with the Barnes situation. The Barnes pump doesn't seem to have clogged near as often or ever. We've, <laughs> we've never plugged one yet, so they've been a great addition to the pump stations as well. There are several features that we liked about the Barnes pump. One, obviously, was a five-year warranty they come with, and also the new plug-and-play, which allows an operator to go out on the site and be able to unplug the cord off the top just by taking two bolts out, unplugging the cord, putting a cap on it. That way you could leave the cord in the station itself and then just pull the pump, take the pump away and get it repaired and put back. If you're in an emergency situation, any time that you could save help. We've worked with American Pump Repair for probably the last five, five years, I believe. We've got quite a few other pumps in the system and they've always been a real good vendor for us as far as being able to be available when we need them and the products are available relatively quickly, a lot better than the competitors. We've been in situations where we've had to wait on other pump vendors to get us what we needed and American Pump and Barnes seems to be relatively quick about that. The Barnes SH non-clog series keep lift stations clog free and eliminate expensive emergency service calls. Lift stations can operate efficiently year after year, even through times of expansive growth.